Welcome everyone. I just started the first prediction, so I think I'm going to jump into the game. I usually don't bother for the first round, or you know, the first run because there's not too many people here, but I thought I'd go anyway. Anyway, yeah, so apparently this is what I left off with last time <laughs> on Friday or Wednesday. Today is Friday. Oh my god. Okay, I could take this and then go for like some level up stuff. I did get the pug. No, I didn't get the pug last time. What did I get? I remember I got the pelican with something, but I can't remember what the something was. Ah, <laughs> uh, who knows. I can go for a level up build then, because there's still uh, the pug and the blobfish that I need. So I do think I take this. Yeah, okay. So I like this then. Hummingbird? Oh, you're right, it was the hummingbird. No, 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 because I got that separately, I think. We did get the hummingbird last time, but I don't think it was on the same run. But Red, hello. Fossil craft, hello as well. Uh, I did start buying all the ducklings because I do need that. So that's still a possibility. I could like buy that. Honestly, this run's probably just going to explode. So <laughs> maybe I'll just push into it even harder. Try and keep the duckling. Am I doing well today? I could be doing better. I don't know. Starting, well, mostly starting tomorrow, but I'm, I need to make changes soon <clears throat> in general. Major, major bugs kill. Hello, Bean Bagel. Welcome, everyone. Techno. It's 6 a.m. where you are. Why are you up at 6 a.m.? Sorry, my voice, my voice is like scratchy today. <clears throat> and I have no idea why. All right, I'm going to do the upgrade now because I wouldn't mind finding like a clownfish or I may even go for starfish. If I find early starfish, I could do a buy sell build here. Wouldn't be too bad. We got the clownfish. Okay, we are, we are definitely doing level up stuff then. I think I'll be taking both of those. We don't need more of that. We definitely don't need any of this. Okay. This is still good. One more duck, one more baby duckling, and then we have a uh, a pretty big thing on the team. I'm hoping to find a lot more level up things though, <laughs> like a load of clownfish maybe. Is time still a command? It should be. Is it not? Wait. Yeah, there you go. It's 1 p.m. for me. We did find a pug, nice. So, I think I get rid of the mouse now. I think I'm going to try and keep the duckling. It's one of the things I need. It's like, I might start scaling that. Get rid of this, keep pumping stats into it. And I take these two. I'm not going to buy the toad. It's not bad for level ups, and it's got a decent ability, but... Yeah, if we're going for a level up build, we kind of need to <laughs> pivot off and find lots of other things. I think this turn... Yeah, this turn I just go for another pug, but I freeze this, I have them like this, and everything seems fine. I'm going to freeze a cucumber as well. I'm probably keeping like everything on the board. Like, I'm going to combine the pugs eventually, probably not right away, but yeah, I think it could be good to start scaling health on another one. First time I caught you on stream. Hello, Ito. Glad you could make it. Right, so we're definitely doing this, and I'm doing it this turn as well. I like, I'm not keeping that frozen for a whole turn, and I'm not, like, combining there, just have this separate. So, uh, yeah, what do you have for me? Mantis, not interested. Definitely don't need that. I, I could just get another cucumber, honestly. I'd rather get pepper on this long term. So maybe I do roll... Like, we're, t we're still turn 3, or tier 3, so I could just roll for a little more upgrades. I think that's probably more meaningful. Blobfish... Sure, I will take a blobfish. We can go <laughs> clownfish, pug, jellyfish, blobfish. And I'll run them all. I can't actually pill blobfish. I could have I could like maybe use a praying mantis to try and get that sort of value out of it, but I don't think it's worth it. <laughs> Imagine being in BST time cringe. I know. Incredibly cringe. Alright, so please. More of these. I need level ups pretty badly right now. Oh, Hey, okay, that's better. So, there's not really a good way to leave anything here. <laughs> I could do this, maybe, because this is going to get leveled up either way. So, I could just use this. I'm going to put it on there for extra stats. Like, I could put both onto the clownfish, and then it does get a level 2, and then we get more stats total, I think. But it's on a worse thing. Uh, I'm going to try that. It might be better. It's a bit risky, though. Actually, no, is that worse? Because the... This happens after the jellyfish, so this doesn't get any extra stats. 
Thankfully, it didn't matter. <laughs> we still crushed them. But I think that was worse order. Alright, so I will be... Yeah, I'm buying both of these. We're definitely not doing a pelican. Triceratops. Obviously, great. Not with this. Definitely not with this. Can't really use any of this. Like, I could throw cheese on something. Hold on. So, what do I want here? <laughs> I really don't know. Like, I need the level ups happening. Uh, it all feels weird. I'm going to buy the cheese, though. I think that's fine. What's your opinion on boiled potatoes? Boiled potatoes? They're okay, I guess. I don't know. I've only had them in, like... <laughs> Hold on. Rexvio, thank you for the six months. That's very generous. Thank you. But yeah, boiled potatoes. I've had them for, like, roast dinners, I guess, and they are okay. That's really my opinion. I don't love them, but they exist. <laughs> yeah, like, I, I don't think I can get any value out of the extra, like, clownfish level up here, other than on itself, so I think that's fine to leave at the front. feel a bit bad having the jellyfish all the way, like, this far back, so maybe I should have put that in front of the duckling. But overall, I think this is pretty good. Yeah, we're fine. Still a good team. Jacket potato? Now those I'm a fan of. <laughs> I actively like jacket potatoes. Oh, I wish I could use this for something. Alright, well, we start here, I guess. I'd love to, like, buy and sell the zebra as well, but I'd have to sell the clownfish. Which I could do, maybe? Hold on, I'd definitely start here. <laughs> we have an orca. I could get rid of the clownfish, just so I can buy and sell the zebra, and that's like two clownfish triggers. And I'm probably not going to get this leveled up, so if I find another one later, then it's probably worth it. I think the extra stats for that are worth something here. I can buy these. Do I have any extra money? Alright, so what do I want to level up? Just these two? I want this to trigger first, either way. And I know I'm wasting, like, plus one one, because this can only level up one time, but... I still think this is the better order. Because then this gets leveled up, so that when this one does, then these both are level 2 for extra extra stats. So I think it works out. That's a little bit of a sad trade. Oh, never mind, it killed it. <laughs> I didn't even notice. What's my favorite pet hat? The pirate hat out of the normal ones. Out of the others, I have no, like, no clue. <laughs> Alright, this is pretty nice. Hammerhead shock, I'll take that for this turn, if nothing else. I need to hope that I won't die. <laughs> Please, let me live. Oh. I want to live. Yeah, we can leave it like this. Okay. Maybe get one jelly for jelly pug combo. Now nah, I just leveled it up. I did want to find another clownfish. I'm surprised I managed to find three. <laughs> all in the same turn. We don't have anything we need for like a an achievement yet though. But there's a lot of time left in the run. So things can still happen. Right, so Hammerhead is going. I'm wondering, I'll probably start with the clownfish, right? Yeah, so start with this. What do you have? Sabertooth. Nah. <laughs> We're probably locked in. Uh, I'm just wondering whether I try and scale better. Like, a carrot on this is, you know, doubles the efficiency, or I could put one on the clownfish because it's not really doing much by itself. I think I'd still rather get a pepper on this. I may leave that dead. Then let's roll a bit. Can't use jellyfish anymore. Uh, blobfish is still something that I need, so I don't mind keeping that. And then I can do this now? Wait, I'd have to move that behind, though. So now I will get a level up on the clownfish, so that means I will get, you know, plus 6-6 six, six when it <laughs> levels up. Plus the 2-2 two, two or whatever it is from this, so it'll get quite big. Yeah, no reason to put it on there, so we can send that like it is. Any tips for the weekly pack? I'm not on it at the moment. I'm on pack 3. Or, you know, the second expansion pack. But I haven't tried it too much. Oh, Sad. <laughs> Alright. Rip that run. We got to 5 trophies. Alright. Well, let's see. Prediction as a no. And we'll start up the next one. Don't most people want to live? Uh, you'd be surprised. I'd hope so. <laughs> this weekly pack is awful. I can't really remember what's in it. I feel like there's chocolate, so I thought it might be okay for, um... Wait. Yeah, there is chocolate. So I might I might do some achievement hunting in there, too. 
But I've actually had decent success going on this pack, and there's still a load of things I need. Like, I could go for a Salamander game, maybe. Obviously not straight away, <laughs> but it's something. Uh, I guess I'll take these. Probably not going for the Duckling again. Find a Cold Aquino stream. Hello, Cody. Glad you could make it. What's the best food in SAP? I mean, my opinion is chocolate. <laughs> Definitely chocolate. Uh, but I don't know if there's an actual answer. I feel like the game's fairly well balanced. Just like getting level ups. Oh, Pill is also really good. I don't know. If, I, I don't think that's what you're <laughs> going for, Eula. But yeah, I think Pill is also one of my favorite foods, despite it not really being food. I'm just going to leave it like this. I can't be bothered. <laughs> we can have that at the front. It's fine. We can just summon builds. Hmm. Oh, that didn't work, but nothing really worked, so it's, it's fine. How's Playtop yesterday? I didn't play yesterday. We played Playtop on, uh, what is, was it? Wednesday? I mean, I didn't. <laughs> I played Playtop with uh, Stuffy yesterday. But yeah, with Scooty, that was pretty fun. And I might be doing it again on Sunday. I think that is our next plan. I think GNG is going to be showing up, maybe, if he's free. Double Occupy. Uh, I need Occupy. Okay. Well, that's definitely something we can do then. Getting broccoli is kind of tempting too. But I <laughs> can't freeze it. I think I might even... I can't double sell. I don't know if it's worth double buying broccoli. It actually probably is. There's not much else I want to do next turn. But then I'm going to have to sell one of these and it's going to replace the broccoli anyway. So uh, nothing really feels good here. We'll get by. Do a roll build, Kina. I mean, I'm planning to. We have two early Ocathies. We kind of have to go for an early one at least. If I live. Apple pie build. No. No, no, no. Alright, so I could double buy here and then I could start selling. I think that's fine because I will have time to roll as well. And this thing will be like super healthy. Uh, I'd probably still put it on here, right? I'd, I'd, I'd rather have high health. I'm not buying any more. <laughs> broccoli, so. Yeah, I'm going to roll a bit, though. Instead of buying one of these, let's just roll to get these big. So I hopefully don't lose again. Yeah, we don't need any of that. Okay, yeah, this is looking okay to me. Do I have Terraria? I do, but I haven't really played this. I have, like, two hours in the game or something. Really not a lot. Hyena? No. Hyena is, like, Awful. <laughs> Not a fan of hyena. All right. Really, I am just looking for like Ocopies and uh, capybaras here. Like, I don't mind spending most of my turn rolling, but I do want to find things as well. I'm not buying any more of those. I'm not going for any of these level ups. All right. Let's keep going, I suppose. Uh, scaling health on this is pretty good, actually. I'll take like another one of those, maybe. Or I could use starfish. I'm probably going to be rolling a lot, and starfish is good in this pack. Although I do want to combine them eventually, I don't know. Sort of stats between adjacent things. Ah, uh, I'm wondering what I can even use that on. Because I'm getting a lot of stats on this, but I don't feel like I can <laughs> swap it to something else. Nah, I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to do stuff or scaling. I'm locking in, I think. This is like outer triggers. Fine, let's just take one of those. Put it at the back, because it doesn't really matter. I like where the stats are already. Terraria's your favorite game. You have over a thousand hours in it. I only have a, like a thousand hours in a few games, and I think they're mostly FPS games when I was like a kid. The newer ones being just Overwatch, I think. And we found another one. Great. Uh, so there's no way I'm going for level 3 Seahorse. Like, I, I don't think I keep that, so I can probably just sell this now for the money. And then like, roll these. I will be combining these eventually. And by eventually, I mean pretty soon, probably. And that means I can buy fried shrimp, and it is like a permanent plus three attack, because very soon the health differences are going to matter. It'll get negated, so. Actually, I'll be plus two, because this thing's already at three. But now we roll. We need to find more of these. Capybara is also very nice. Yeah, we'll take one of those. Another capybara. Uh, sure. <laughs> I can sell the frog, swap, like. I, I'm hoping these aren't just terrible, 
temporary stats. I'm not sure how it works. I imagine if you swap the stats, they'll decrease, and then I'm in the worst position, but I want to see it anyway. <laughs> it's been forever since I've done something like this. I think this is well, actually. Then this gets a plus two when I uh, stack them. Yeah, let's do that, actually. So this is small. I can stack that there. Buy these two. Roll once more. Okay. Definitely don't need any of this. Maybe put that to the back. Those are fine where they are. Who do I main in Overwatch? I don't really have mains. I mean, my, I have, like, mains from each of the, <laughs> the roles. I like playing Ana as support. I like playing Soldier as DPS. And I like Zarya and Roadhog as tank. How can we temp stats on Emperor Tamrat, though, B? I've never tried that. It does sound pretty interesting, though. Alright. <laughs> Lion, no, not interested. Like, I could just roll and get, like, huge things from the shop anyway, so... Let's do that. Another one of these. I could combine again. I think I'd rather just roll. Like, there's a load of triggers here, and if we find more capybaras or something, then we're in amazing shape. Crow is also great. So I'll be buying that, and... Do I do it this turn? I think I do. We get a load of stats too, and we probably don't need to roll. Like, this thing is... This thing is huge. Alright. Let's do it like that. I am hoping my 1122 will be enough to, like, carry a fight to. For a Tamarind, Cupcake is an amazing early combo. Don't you have to level it up for that to be worth it, though? Otherwise, you're just getting, like, plus 1-1 one, one or something. Like, I feel like a regular Emperor, Emperor Tamarind or whatever it's called isn't... isn't very good. Yeah, and I'm probably not getting another level up anytime soon. I mean, I could go for it, maybe. I don't know what my odds are. These just aren't very good. Like, I could look for just decent tier 4s instead of <laughs> forcing a roll build. Nah, let's go for it. Like, oh god, there's more. Okay. <laughs> there's more XP as well. Also great. Okay, we definitely need to reorder a bit. I'm thinking this way. So that can probably take like one of the heaviest hits. If this doesn't kill the front line, then it may kind of suck because then <laughs> we may like double trade in something big, but it's not enough. <laughs> ah, we win, but it's, yeah, that was not, that was the bad trade. And I've already seen this name today. We're definitely fighting the same people like over and over recently. Alright, so I think I'm just going to go for another level up on this for now, instead of, like, leveling the Calmfish. I think that is... Okay... Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay, Velociraptor could be amazing as well. We obviously don't have a Strawberry build, but having that equipment could be really good. Like, long term. I think I do take that. <laughs> we do have another Rock Bee. I think we freeze. We could probably take a Carrot on something. We do need to get to Strawberry. It's also Husky for scaling. Hmm. Hmm. No, I don't think we're doing Husky scaling. Okay, that is great. Some more XP. Fox is interesting as well. Like, Fox could be really good. That could be our scaling. I think I take that. So we're freezing a lot of things. I think next turn I combine my Capybaras. I stack the Occupy on here. Or maybe I'll just sell the Clownfish and run, like, double Occupy or something. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm doing something with all of this. I was on three times in a row in a game once. <laughs> I thought people, like... I don't know. I definitely have games before when I've ran into the same people, like, over and over again. Or, like, you know, in pairs. So I'd run into, like, the same four opponents twice in a run or something. It's like, that's really dumb. But for the most part, it's usually fine. Anyway, I don't actually need the cap. I need... I need both of these. I keep this then. <laughs> I definitely keep it. I think I'm going to give this the strawberry so we have protection on this because it's already pretty big. And it's going to get bigger whenever I do this. Ostrich. That's interesting as well, actually. Uh, what's the play here? We actually don't have many tier fives in the shop, though. <laughs> it's a fairly high level shop considering I'm probably buying this this turn, but I don't know. It might be worth getting this. Like, that's kind of my only scaling option at the moment. 
Yeah, because I'm not really going to be able to use these. Ah, no, because if I just, like, roll and buy one of these, like, later, then it's going to be even bigger. So, either way, I don't, like, rely on this yet. If I find another one in the wild, then sure, but I don't think I buy it now. So, for now, let's just... What? Buy a fox, let it steal the food. I'm going to roll again. I'm going to let another food appear and <laughs> see what happens. I'm probably selling that soon. Alright, so there's a chance it steals broccoli, but that's not too upsetting. I can survive that. It's still broccoli, okay. <laughs> Do I play Minecraft? I haven't for a while, but I'd like to. Uh, that's very spooky. We're just dead, right? I haven't had any HP. Yeah, okay. There we go. Four trophies. Oh, Kalu, hello! Sorry, I'm not sure if that was your first message. Stream Minecraft? I don't know what I'd stream. I don't even play Minecraft! When the Minecraft stream is stuffy coming. I don't know anything about mods, so I, like, I, again, I've, I used to watch a ton of Minecraft, and I used to play it a lot on, like, mobile. I used to play it a lot on PC as well, but that was much younger. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't know what I'd do. I haven't been keeping up. There's a lot of new things. And as far as I can tell, a lot of people don't even use <laughs> vanilla. It's all uh, mods these days. Damn. Those were some terrible trades. Okay, well, I'm taking this. Hummingbird on a cockroach isn't too bad, so I could, like, maybe take one of those. If I find it. <laughs> Alright, well, we're going for the level 3 frog this game, then. Because I have, like, no other options. And I'm just gonna let whatever happens happen. I don't mind if everything gets shuffled around. Sad frog gang. I don't see why they had to make him so sad. At least his eyes look more bored than sad, but it's... It's not nice. This poor guy. If you stop playing Minecraft, I'll have to reconsider my subscription. What's wrong with Minecraft? Minecraft's a good game. I just haven't played it in a long time. Alright, Woodpecker I'm taking. Leech I'm tempted, but it's more of a late game thing, I feel. Unless I find those of <laughs> koalas. Honestly, I probably just take both of these. I can like double sell here, double buy. And it's an improvement, and if I find koalas, then this is worth it. Or well, less bad. <laughs> Yeah, saying it's worth it isn't exactly true, but sure. You can eat one of the frogs, it's fine. Eventually they're getting combined and the health difference won't matter. You'd also have to reconsider. I mean, is this if I play it at all, or if I <laughs> do it a little bit on the side? Because I definitely wouldn't be doing a hard pivot. I just may do Minecraft at some point. Finally got time to catch a stream. Hello, Vato. Welcome. All right. Uh... <laughs> Vato, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you very much. It's not my thing, but each their own. It's only a joke, don't worry on my part. I mean, it sounded like a joke, so it's fine. But yeah, I do like Minecraft. I just haven't, again, played it in a long time. I can't really be bothered with the grindy games as much anymore. Hey, Rich, found one. All right. Uh, no, because we're keeping this. Yeah, so now I want to hurt this one, because it will actually be gaining attack. <laughs> I don't want to, like, lose... I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm still doing on that one, though. <laughs> Let's keep rolling. I'd like to combine next turn, but... Oh. That could tempt me otherwise. Alright, if I go for a tier 4, what would I be looking for? There's not really much. It's more the tier 5s, because I'd love to find one of these. Or maybe even, like, a saber tooth. But yeah, I'll just do this this turn so I can get more scaling. That's tempting, but... No, we're fine. We can survive without. We're actually scaling the frog now. New hat, you want to see in the update? I have no clue. I mean, did you guys see the uh, the announcement yesterday? Hey, <laughs> Teamwood tweeted out and they have like a few new pets and a few new hats they showed. And I'm pretty sure it said that they're going to be like reworking the backgrounds as well. With a toggle so you can see the old ones. But everything looked really cool. Like... <laughs> so many frogs too. More bugs. They did say more bugs and then less bugs. I'm hoping they do add more bugs though. I want like more of everything. I want more birds, more fish, more bugs. There's just so many things they could do on like those fronts. Alright. Uh fried shrimp. Stacking a load of fried shrimp on like here wouldn't be bad, but maybe I just look for upgrades or <laughs> I don't know. Something. 
Hmm. I don't know what my odds are of actually getting a level up here. I feel like that's probably not going to be doing too much for us. Like, it's only these that I can get value out of there. I will scale one of these, because I'm probably going to keep it for a while. And... I don't... I don't know. <laughs> Do I want to try and level up the leech? Maybe. I'm probably keeping it. I think I want to go for, like, a hurt build. Like, I'd like to pivot off the koalas eventually and just get a triceratops instead. So I can just leech triceratops and then I don't need to worry as much about... I mean, I guess I still probably want to scale the triceratops, but I think by then the koala scaling is going to be not worth it anymore. <laughs> Vatos Loco! Thank you for the tier 1 sub as well! Going all out already, thank you very much. The sun is right outside your window. The sun gets outside my window in like the evening, so I'm safe at the moment. But it's kind of like, we've been seeing so many of these frogs, and I want to say I'm for it, but I'm not. <laughs> I don't want these things. Alright, that's kind of cool, we'll save it for next turn. I'm probably leaving the woodpecker. Like, there's no, um, whatever it's called. Pineapple, so like, I feel like the woodpecker's not as amazing as it could be. We'll continue though, you can keep <laughs> swapping the stats, I guess. It's either that or I swap stats, like, onto the, uh, the koala, which is an idea, to be fair. Like, if I'm selling this, I probably shouldn't be, like, spreading out the stats between the, the leech and the woodpecker by, like, shuffling to every turn, even though they're still scaling. The log splitter. I feel like I've seen him today as well. Okay, anyway, easy upgrades. Husky. Uh... We could maybe do this. I could like pivot off um pivot off weird leech scaling and go like husky, orangutan, and find something else. I'm kind of for that. I, I could like keep the koalas. I could just like get rid of this, do this, buy that, and then roll a bit. We have the level up as well. Okay, so this still works. This still works. We're only like scaling two things, but <laughs> it's it's enough for now. I think I'd rather this get the stats there. I don't even know though, like everything's going to be taking damage. It's all strange. What I might need to do is get Pepper on this, just so it breaks and I can start scaling it with Husky. It's going to be strange, but maybe it's the play. We did that with a, uh, a Yak recently, so we can get more scaling than we would otherwise. Kind of funny. Hello Bimbaz. Bring back the Tiger Cup. Tiger Cup? No, I like it as it is. It used to be a tiger, and now it's a tiger again. And I'm all for it. Uh, can I even use this? The stat increase would be nice, and we have like a cool combo going here, and next turn... I don't want to sell any of these three, I don't want to sell. I could maybe get rid, rid of the orangutan and not feel bad about it. Plus if I like find another one, maybe that's worth it, but it's also really big now. <laughs> uh... What could I even be looking for this turn? More frog? No, there's no room for more frog. I'm gonna leave this. I don't think we can really do anything there. Definitely no more scalar stuff. I'll take multiple huskies if I find more. Yeah, there's really like nothing I'm looking for here, so... I'm just gonna <laughs> do this and send it, I guess. It's a bit of an improvement. Sap updated and ready to see if I can get into the view lobby later. Oh, thank you, Bato. Glad you've been enjoying the videos. And yeah, there'll definitely be room. <laughs> I haven't decided what we're going to do for the viewer lobbies yet, though. I may make a new pack, because there's definitely going to be time for it today. So, yeah, Pepper. I could Pepper this, it'll break because of the leech, and then the Husky will be scaling three things. And that is an improvement. I mean, this is a slight improvement. I don't think it's worth it with a level 1 husky, though. I may do it later. What's more important is that I find a triceratops. <laughs> Alright, great. And we still have a pepper as well, so... Not bad. Alright. Here we go. We have something different. I'm probably going to keep the team, like, roughly as it is. So, like, this is only scaling these two now, and I... I could, like, always move that back and then do that to get rid of the equipment, but... For now, I think I'd rather just get the scaling off this. I don't think it's worth moving it back and forth just for that. This is very interesting. Uh, if I'm leaving... 
I can't really get this one off, and I'm keeping it, so I might as well just upgrade that equipment. But yeah, I may eventually sell the husky and then try and get a, uh, you know, <laughs> this leveled up. I think the scaling from that is going to be way more important. I may even do it next turn now. This is like much bigger. Reptiles only. I think I did have a pack for that. I'm not sure if I've removed it yet. And roll pets only. That we haven't done in a long time. Maybe we will do just something like capybaras only or hamsters only. Because it's been a while since we did either and both were really fun. And I'll take a draw. <laughs> Anything that keeps me alive. No, we don't need that. Husky, you're done. He may be back, but not yet. Can I just get another koala? That could do. We don't need the achievement or anything, but... It's something to have on the team, maybe. <laughs> no, because then if it gets the Triceratops buff, it's just a waste. So, carrot, it's something, but no... Fox. Fox is something I'm much more interested in, especially with, like, this food. Sure, okay, so... Unfreeze again. I don't need to freeze these, like, permanently, because I'd rather get the tier 4 stuff. I also don't really want stats getting swapped again. So I guess I leave the frog at the front now. And yeah, I should probably still give it pepper. If I live. <laughs> yeah, I definitely should give it pepper. Dinosaur only. We've done that. Yeah, if we do dinosaur only, it's actual dinosaurs. Or the prehistoric type stuff. A hey. Lovely. Okay, Peppa on this is great. I think I'm keeping the fox, honestly. I think this we need. I'm probably just going to freeze this, because I still really want to get the Triceratops upgrade. <laughs> oh, I can't buy both of these. I'm going to buy the hot dog, and then roll, and just hope I can find another semi-decent stat food. I'm not trusting that. You know what? I don't mind, if, I don't mind it stealing popcorn. We will freeze that for this turn. Yeah, this is fine. I think this is the squad we have now. Kind of interested in getting, like, one of these, because extra gold every turn is quite big. But, yeah. This, this is working. Can you lose, pretty please? I'm not planning to. I may do, but it won't be intentional. Okay, let's just buy this now and keep rolling. Definitely can't do that. We got the upgrade! Perfect! Right, so maybe I just, like, buy, <laughs> buy cheese? There's not really good defensive equipment I can put on this thing. Like, I definitely don't want pepper. I could put popcorn, maybe. Or, like, some scaling food. Scaling food wouldn't be terrible. I'm gonna do that this turn, though. Anything to hopefully, like, pop the front line easier. But yeah, we do need the fox achievement as well, which is why I'm <laughs> trying to force this a little bit. We're okay, right? Yeah. Oh. Yes, we are okay. <laughs> that was closer than I wanted, but it was okay. Okay, well, that is scaling food. I'm probably going to... Honestly, I'm probably keeping this whole build, so let's just start scaling that. I'm not going to put it on the fox in case I end up, like, it having to steal equipment food. Which I'd rather it not do, but it may happen. I'm going to leave carrots. I don't think carrots are... Okay, those two are fine. Found another fox, perfect. And I'm keeping both of those frozen. Whatever it doesn't buy, we're either buying ourselves or we're um, freezing for the end of next turn. So, yeah, leave everything frozen. I don't think I really need to rearrange. Yeah, I don't want anything in front of the frog. Like, I don't want my <laughs> giant Triceratops stats getting swapped onto anything else. That was kind of a waste. All the stats went on my, like, two semi-useless things. That's pretty nice. Extremely close, but pretty nice. Okay. Oh, good things. Komodo. Uh, so I definitely want the fox to eat the hot dog. I may freeze both of these and then, like, roll a ton of times just looking for, like, what? Fox <laughs> level ups and then buy this when I have three gold left. So I have, like, four rolls if I need. Okay, well... There we go, so we're guaranteed to get the hot dog, which doubles by two, so we get, like, plus 16 attack here. 
which seems pretty good. I'm hoping it goes on something that won't be a waste. I'd actually like the stats to spread out more, so if it's like these two again, it's pretty good. That's not bad either. Oh my god, Kino stream! Hello, M. <laughs> Glad you can make it. And this team is beautiful. I'm hoping it's enough. We are scaling kind of fast now, and we're getting into the end game. So at the very least, we should get the frog achievement. I'm hoping. We're also on like no HP, so I'm a little scared we're about to die. Freeze that. I can't. I can't go for the <laughs> the fox like this. I'm not gonna be greedy. I'm gonna let uh, the crow go. I think. Okay, and then I can buy one of these and take the other one. I think I'd rather health. Yeah, so I buy attacks, we get double the value out of health. Yeah, nice. And then I'm hoping that I can find <laughs> two foxes in my shop, but other than that, uh, yeah, we'll just... Oh. Bit of a scary team, but this thing is huge, so we're fine. And chance you're going to do viewer lobbies. We do every stream. Every, uh, sap stream, anyway. But yeah, that's going to be starting in, like, an hour. Oh, wait. An hour and 20. We have a docket command. That's, like, my stream schedule thing. Anyway, let's just keep that frozen. I really would like to roll a bit. See if I can find any of those. I don't mind kind of wasting a turn. And now there's no chance I'm going to get it, so maybe I... No. Sure. <laughs> Alright. Hello, crow. It's not going to happen. We just embrace the frog achievement, which I do need, right? Yes. And still no better order. I'm kind of sad I didn't never got, like, pepper or something for that. I should have been looking, but <laughs> I've had, like, stat food frozen, like, all the time. I think we'll survive, though. We're really big. You don't usually see huge teams in this build, uh, this pack, except for starfish things. <laughs> oh my god, we lost. Ah, oh, why? Why does it do this to me? <laughs> We would have been fine if we had a pepper. I think. I assume. Okay. What's the prediction? Six more tro- Oh, there isn't a prediction. Never mind. I'll start a prediction. <laughs> Alright. We do go again, though. And I'm not touching any of these. I want the late game stuff. I think after this one, when we hit, like, the hour, maybe, I'm going to swap over to the weekly. See if I can do anything there. You already paid it out. So I, I can't keep track. I'll take an iguana. There's a chance we get something out of that later. And I don't like any of this, but I will take a frog because it's got like better stats than the other things there. And we'll be the foamy ghosts. You know, really do be snacking today. What are you talking about? I don't know what my job is. I don't know when I'm in charge. Alright, definitely taking this. You know what? I'm taking that as well. Anything this. <laughs> okay. Important note, I'm not going for the cockroach level 3. That is not something we need, nor something that I want to do. So I'm getting the upgrade, so we have something with decent stats. But that is it. And it is definitely enough. More roach, no. Only level 2. And a level 2 iguana as well. Ockapi, I will definitely be taking that. What else do you have? <laughs> it's another double Ockapi! Okay. Easy choice, I think. I'm still sad that they butchered broccoli and uh, fried shrimp. It always feels bad to take now. Like, I might still go for it, but... It used to be so much better. <laughs> Why not get the best pet to level 3? Oh, you're right. The best pet in the game, Cockroach. I think it's objectively the worst pet. I already have Stork. I might have gone for that otherwise. And yeah, I'm going to do that, because then I can roll a bit. You know what? Sure, take one of these two. I'm not going to take the other one, just... <laughs> I want to roll. I'm actually not sure what I'm rolling for, though. So it's just so I don't lose the game, but... You can swap those two. I don't care about the rest. I want these two to have their stats. Calibi Worky... So I let Kino do Kino things and just keep an eye out if something needs a nudge. Okay. I assume that means I'm in charge of the predictions. I'll keep an eye on it. Double cast wear is interesting as well. Obviously, starfish scaling isn't too bad, but 
Cassowary is something that I need, and I may take that, because I can ditch these and feel fine. And there's not many early summons other than, like, Stork, so I can probably ditch the Iguana before this, just for the, the stats. I run these separately, and I'm really hoping that I find either more of these, more of these, or a Strawberry. <laughs> we actually got all of it! All of it in one turn! This game knows what's up. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm putting on this, because... Why not? I'll freeze that. There's more. Oh my god. These don't synergize together, but I don't... Wait. Oh, it doesn't work on itself. It's a strawberry friend thing. I didn't know that. I'd forgotten. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I can just say... <laughs> uh, actually, no, it kind of matters. I can combine them all here, because I, I need to go for this cassowary achievement. So I'm gonna do this. So it's gonna scale, scale twice as fast, so I think that's worth it. And maybe just like buy these this time. Hmm. I'm wondering whether I take a broccoli next turn as well. The stats on that would be pretty good. I think I do. So I don't stack that there. I can stack it here and feel fine, maybe. Or maybe I stack it there, freeze both. I'm leaving the capybara. We don't need that. Still kind of sad that we don't have any <laughs> scaling on this cassowary, but it'll have to do for now. I can combine it later and then give something else strawberry. That is a spooky team. We can actually get that to level 3. Hmm, not yet. Not yet, but I may do that. Alright, first, what is this? Wait, do I do that? Hamster's interesting. I think I'm going to leave that, so I buy-sell this to get the chocolate out, but keep it frozen. There's not much other, like, buy-sell stuff I'm really going for. Okay, that looks okay to me. I really don't know what I'm doing with this. Like, I really do. I need to give the cassowary some different equipment. Probably some, like, scaling food. These are terrible trades. Is this run going to die? Hmm. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna trust that this is where I need to put the stats, uh, the level up thing, I mean. And honestly, just get scaling, my dude. I need that to scale as well. I'd rather roll. These things have loads of triggers left, and we kind of need it. Sure. More scaling food. It's better than the tier 4 stuff, I think. Oh, no, because there's... No, there's better stuff at tier 5. Yeah, we'll leave that then. I'm hoping this is enough. Like, this should be safe. I need to find something I can stick a strawberry on and feel okay about. Did this even scale? I didn't see. Oh my god. What are these teams? There's always one super big thing. Ah. <laughs> Hello, pugs. Alright, well, I think it's time to get rid of that. This definitely isn't a vulture game, but I don't know what else I can take. I could go for foxes. Buying and selling zebras is good. Can't do huskies anymore. That's fine if I find other things. But that's mostly next tier. I'm gonna leave the vulture. Alright. <laughs> I can't get that leveled up without having to, um... No, let's do it on that. Alright. Ostrich. We're probably just dead, honestly. I'm almost tempted to, like, sell one of these cassowaries just so I get an extra roll. Because that's, like, another 3-3 three, three in the fight. But then we don't actually scale, so it's, uh... Bad time all around. And that's fine. Those are both fine. Alright. Well, let's see what happens. I'm going to freeze that because... You know, I'm going ostrich next turn. Don't die. I think I'm dead. <laughs> this, this run is not going anywhere. Yeah, no. We had no chance. No chance. Yes, we had, we had great luck in finding these two things, but... Yeah. <laughs> that was it. We did not have good luck against opponents. Buy, sell, build, man, learn. What do you mean? I'm look. You're fine. You want me to buy, sell, build? I have a buy, sell pack. There we go. <laughs> Let's get some wins then. I'll take a pig as well. All right. With the broken cucumbers. I don't actually remember what that. I don't. I don't remember what the payout thing was. And someone's already doing it. It's a no. Thank you, I assume Kalu. 
Alright, and we're taking one of these. I usually don't like having so many mosquitoes, because I like to pivot off them in this pack eventually, but for now, we might as well. It's one big thing. Bicell is so boring. I mean, I don't really know what else to do. I don't know how... To, like, what are your guys' opinions on achievement hunting packs? Because I have no clue what to do. This is the best one I have, and it is just like a bicell build thing. Uh, let's just keep that in here. Keep that a little further back. Don't want any of this. <laughs> I will go for another level up there, I suppose. No, my freezer pill. I'm probably going to use that on there soon. That is great. I didn't even see. How did this thing get weakness? Do they have a toad already? Okay, I'm doing it this turn. There's like so many good buy sell things at tier 3. Well, like those two, but like, you know, blobfish would be nice as well. Capybara is not bad for next turn. Even though the clownfish isn't terrible. <laughs> Emperor Tamarin is not it. What else do you have? Now, also not really what I wanted, but I will take it at least. Let's take those two. I don't think it's worth freezing these. Like, it might be if I had something in mind that I wanted to buy sell them, but I really need to find dogs or starfish as soon as I can. So let's just leave it like that. No freezing. Take the tam? No. <laughs> it's not good. Mm. That's rough. Alright, yeah. We still don't need any of these. I don't really need the pill anymore. Uh, we do just need to roll until I find dogs or starfish. Can't even use that very well. Star okay, double starfish. <laughs> it's exactly what we needed. Uh, I can't get rid of the Mosquito, so I think that might be a permanent part of our team now. Maybe? It's either that or I try and force, like, all the stats onto the Goldfish and, like, start over <laughs> this turn. We do have, like, 7 HP to spare. So that might be survivable. And it gives me a lot more money this turn. I'm actually going to go for that. Extremely risky, but I need to see it. And I'm probably going to end up losing this, because I think I'm selling the mouse this turn. Hey, it hit what I wanted. Don't hit the mouse. It didn't hit the mouse. Great. Goodbye, garlic. You'll be missed. I'm... I'm just still going to put it on there, actually. <laughs> I guess. Uh, sell the duck first, because I do need to roll to find more sell things. I do know there's one here. But that's fine. Okay. Nah, we only found one. Okay. This works. We did, like, shuffle out our whole team this turn. <laughs> but it's actually not a bad team this turn, and it'll be pretty good later. We do lose, but yeah, we're going to be scaling. How many pets do you still need three wins with or whatever? Um, Like 20, I think? We're like 30 achievements away, but that's, you know, all pairs. Or I, I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> I'm hoping you guys know what I mean. Okay, that's interesting. I think... I think I need to combine my goldfish so they don't, like, the stats don't get spread out. Yeah. Alright. Let's just get all the stats onto this thing if we can. Those are lovely freezes. And... Let's do it that way. Stream until you get to the 100% achievements. No, because that'll take me, like, days! I don't have, like, that many more that I need, but I don't think it's to the point where I'll, um... Be able to do it instantly. Okay. Anyway, we keep doing this. We just got a two squad. <laughs> That's all I need. I only need my massive goldfish. I would love to level him up or something, though. Find cans. Buffalo is pretty good. We probably take a buffalo, but I buy it after I sell that. Okay, and I'm still making sure that gets all the stats. Double buffalo, amazing. There's nothing to freeze, sadly. I may freeze that, actually, because, you know, it's going to be a little bit cheaper, and I can fill that onto a buffalo, which is going to be huge soon. But here we go. Subathon? I, I just wouldn't be... I said that very strangely, first. <laughs> and second, I, I don't think I'd survive it. I don't think I'm a subathon kind of guy. Also, this is beautiful. I'm doing that over the turtle, but I don't know who I'd do it on yet. Maybe... Wait... I think I actually abandoned the turtle, because I don't think I need it at the moment. I think I do this. Excuse me. Because then that resets the triggers. 
Uh, I could buy it and it's still... No, because it's only one cheaper. I'd rather find like actual buy sell things. That's, okay, this is obviously not a sell thing, but we get 2-2 two, two stats out of it anyway, so that's an easy freeze. I'm actually leaving the starfish, I think. Nah, we can try and get that. Like, we have already have, um... No, never mind, the goldfish isn't <laughs> at the next level yet. Alright, that's out of triggers. I can sell it. I can buy this. We get another trigger out of that. We have loads of stuff we like for next turn. Pretty good. And Bruno, hello. Are you going to make that cheap shop pack? Uh, this kind of is that. Oh, wait, what do you mean cheap shop? Like, I have <laughs> goldfish, but that's the only thing that interacts with it like that, right? I'm not really sure. Anyway, I'm not going to run these separately, I think, because I really don't want to run the risk of this hitting the small starfish. So let's just spread things out. <laughs> oh, that would be interesting. What can we do with that? We can always do like a late game pivot with this, maybe. It'd be good if we find like a chicken. I'm going to like buy and sell first and then end on that, I think. Because I don't want it eating up stats. I just want it to be like <laughs> there in case we find something we need. Uh, hmm. I mean, I still do this. Let's say keep it. It's probably better to keep it, right? Yeah, we don't have any more triggers for that. So let's just keep it on the team. Freeze that, I guess. Probably leaving the order like this, too. I don't think it really matters. Goldfish Squirrel. Ah. I don't think I've ever done that. It does make sense, though. Assuming... Hold on. How does that work? If... Like, can this... Can Goldfish discount food if the food works its way all the way to the, like, the far left? Because I know it says pets, but I'm wondering how they coded it. <laughs> Alright. We just need to buy sell here, honestly. We're going to run out of triggers on the alpaca, but it's fine. Alright, keep buffing these. Eventually we want to pivot off this sort of scaling and just have like... I don't even know. We're going to want something, though. Okay. Sell things, please. Okay, this is very interesting. Uh, I think I just pill and then roll some more. I know I there's a buffalo there, but I don't think that's worth taking for anything. Okay, these are amazing. Uh, <laughs> I will freeze this! If we can find another pill, then it's good. If we can't find another pill, then it's, you know, a big waste of a slot, but I'll wait a while. Yeah, <laughs> you're starting to regret voting no. It's because it's a whatever this is called. You know, buy sell builds are pretty easy if you have a good pack for it. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to buy and sell stuff first before I level up the alpaca, because I really don't want these getting the level up buffs. So we'll waste the bad ones and then roll it, see if we can find anything better. And obviously I'm not, like, making room for the beaver. This is going to fly off screen. Okay, and then I'll level it up. What have you got for me? Hammerhead. We don't have any level 3s, sadly. And I already have the Hammerhead achievement, so... I think I'm going to pass on that. <laughs> I don't think that does anything for us. Uh, Lioness is almost interesting. Because it'd be level 2 already. I can, like, buy and sell the Owl, end on the Lioness, and I can still roll. That doesn't seem too bad. That's, like, a good pivot, because then I can swap out this at some point. And maybe even the Owl pack it later. Yeah, let's do that, then. I attempt to freeze that. I do not care for a dragon. Wait. Leopard. Nope. <laughs> and I don't think I need any of this. Mm, I need the capybara, but it's, this is not a capybara situation. <laughs> Alright. I think I need to lemon this. That's going to have to happen. Uh, I could, like, stake the alpaca. Or maybe the lioness. Like, one of those is staying around longer than the other. Or, you know. We're getting rid of some things, so I just need to work out what. You're so nervous for this game. I mean, I could win pretty easily if I was just going all out by self, but I am going to try and get some achievements from it. That's a lot of tigers. <laughs> okay, another alpaca. Another lioness. Okay, we could like virtually abandon the buy selling here. Like, I can maybe do like... No, I can't even do one more because I'd be selling the... Starfish. 
I could buy the alpaca, it will level it to level 2, and then I could buy another lioness. <laughs> if, you know, if I combine them and then level that to level 2, and then... Oh, I don't know. It's kind of a waste there anyway. So maybe I don't do that. I'm getting rid of this. That's happening. I might like just... Yeah, this is just free, but it wastes a trigger. Sell the starfish. No, I've, I've been meaning to do that for a while, but I needed... You know, that was the next thing to go. <laughs> it's fine. Alpaca won't buff other alpacas. You're right, and I forgot, because I never use them. So I can buy that safely, then, without it ruining anything. Alright. Stack that there. That's on buy, so I actually didn't have to buy it separately. That one I did. <laughs> oh, but it wasted a trigger. Alright, I could just... I could end on the walrus, and then it's pretty good, but I think I'd rather just do that. And run them separately, because it's, like, twice as much. Well, now I'm sad that I bought the thing, because I could have had this at level 2. Whatever, let's roll for a bit. I need to find things that are worth buying. I'll do this, but... XP. I don't really need XP. I could maybe go tap it, but there aren't many good, like... Things, like, targets for it that I need. Yeah, no, that wouldn't do anything. Continue rolling. Bulge is something I need. I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm going for on this one. Maybe nothing. Buy lionesses. I'd like to, but I need to find more of them. Can you stop that, please? It tickles. Alright. Uh, <laughs> things I don't really need. Alright, do I need any of these? No. Mm, they are good, but yeah, I, I don't think I touch any of this. Although this one's free money. But it wastes alpaca triggers, so... <laughs> uh, I don't know. This is already going to cap out anyway when I buy like the next thing. Vulture is infuriating, yeah. I know, like, I could get a lot of money out of just, like, buying and selling these, because they'll, like, level up so I can sell them for extra, and this one, it also, like, summons an extra thing, but... I'm going to roll past it, because I don't want to, like, waste the lioness things if I don't find something better to swap in. Maybe. Nah, we have time. Okay, I'll do it this turn. Let's just get some value out of this. Uh, wait. Maybe? Maybe I just, like... Buy that. No, that's not worth it. That's one attack. <laughs> that's, that's definitely not worth it. I will buy this, and then I'm going to roll for a pill for a bit, and I will rearrange, so don't worry about that. Oh, we ran out of triggers. It's because it worked on summon. Yeah, I can't think. All right, we can go for the fox, maybe. We <laughs> can go for a big fox right to the end. Yep. Oh. We can actually do this. <laughs> Okay. Well, I probably just leave it like this then. <laughs> Level three fox. Yeah, and we're gonna get like no value, I think. Oh, I'm lucky that was at the front. <laughs> I think we would have been hard counted if we'd ran into that um that level three lionfish at the back. Okay. Anyway, so we can get rid of the walrus. And then we're just like buying these, I guess. It's probably time to get rid of the lioness too, because it's kind of small. So how can I do this? I could like sell the lioness and then stack the foxes on here with chocolate, and then I can still buy the walrus on the same turn. So then I have a level two walrus, a level three fox, and it steals melon. Or I could melon it and let it steal chocolate. <laughs> oh, I don't really want to get rid of it though. Maybe I do just like buy. I think I just buy into it and freeze, so I can still scale another turn, and I can swap that out next turn. I think that's okay. So yeah, let's do it this way. Bit of a waste, but you know. And then, what is this? Hmm. Actually, it, it doesn't steal. I'd have to buy something. I'll just buy it and let it steal nothing, I guess. I don't know. What are my odds? Like, there's no pills. So I don't need to... No, there are pills. I can't risk rolling. If I roll and it ends up stealing a pill, I will die. <laughs> so I'm going to do this and not let it steal anything. I think that is a slight improvement. And then next turn, the lioness is done, and I think we're getting a level 2, um... Level 2 whatever this thing is. 
Insurance peanut lad. That's terrifying. I think we are losing this one. Okay, another goldfish. No. All right. Yeah, you're done. We don't really need to scale the shop anymore. I think we probably get rid of the goldfish too. Because like its ability doesn't really matter. Yeah, and then we can like get this to level 3, and that's pretty good. Unless we go against another summoning team, which does terrify me. <laughs> nah, alright. This is going this turn as well, I think. Probably. I could like wait, maybe. I don't think I'm touching the hammerhead. Uh... Hmm. I'm trying to think what I want to do with any of these things. Okay. Do I pill one now? Because then, like, it goes on two things. And then I can maybe rearrange the other one to get the other things to have some <laughs> peanuts on. Instead of going for a level three. I think that might be worth it. Because there's, like, I can always just get better stuff in the shop. Like, this is only good for the peanuts. All right, that I love. Yeah, yeah, so this works. Now we just need, like, a better front line. And, you know, maybe freeze stat food that's not going to get me killed. <laughs> that's not a front line. Uh, although I could move it further back, actually. That's not too bad either. I keep it frozen. Not freezing chocolates. Not freezing chocolates. Can I even steal chocolate if it's level 3? Hmm. Who knows? That is out of triggers, right? I'm getting scared. Like, there's only bad food. I could take another one, or just like a, a scorpion. Frontline scorpion. Let's do that, and I'm trusting that I can find stat food. I'll take cupcakes at this stage. Okay, we're freezing both of these. Anything that will help me not die. Okay. Yeah. We have a lot of peanuts. Let's go. <laughs> Plus 9-9. Nine, nine. It's temporary, but it's kind of cool. Hey, it's enough. Peanuts saved us. <laughs> Okay, one more turn. One more turn. Hey, Kino and chat, how's the game going? It's going well, thank you. I assume. We have a lot of peanuts. I need to get rid of the alpaca, but I want to find something to swap it out with first. Hmm. I mean, I could do this to start. I could always get rid of the scorpion, but I don't know if I want to do that. Uh, I mean, that's a lot of free rolls. Kind of. We don't get to roll first. I'm not selling it yet. This is keep going. I just don't know what I'm looking for, honestly. It's not another scorpion. Is, it, is there a cat in this pack? I don't think so. No, there's not. Donkey, no. Maybe I just take a leopard. Like, it's pretty good. I could sell the scorpion and then, like, find something else. Yeah, nice. We do get, uh... I don't know. <laughs> Probably don't care about a Spinosaurus. Maybe I end on an eagle. Yeah, I think we end on an eagle. I think that's a decent finish to this. I can buy this so we steal, like, massive pizza. Uh, I could rearrange, maybe, and do it like this. So then this still has its uh, stuff, and these two end up having peanuts. I'd be a little sad if this runs into something with peanuts, but other than that, I think it's decent. Plus 12, 12. Lovely. Oh my god, what is this? Uh, We're not okay. Yeah, there's no way we can kill that back line. Why? <laughs> oh, it always has to happen. That's what I hate about this game. You can just have a great run and then, you know, bigger fish. <laughs> uh, it's not fair. Alright. Prediction, six or more, yes. Yeah, <laughs> that was pretty hardcore. Yeah, it was a full team of 50-50s. They went for a chicken game where I went for like a an alpaca game. And yeah, there's not much you can do about that.